Start with like, you feeling okay? Put that tumble into the in the crowd there at the very end. Feeling feeling great. Um, I know that's how you play. Um, I guess what was that just caught up in the moment in terms of trying to make a play in the final moments? I, I'm guessing you didn't want to find yourself falling in that fashion. I was just trying to make a play. Uh, I was just about to go and fall. Uh, just get up and keep on moving forward and then go the other way. Uh, now, maybe you can be smarter and try not to uh, you know, jump in the final seconds of the game, you know, because it doesn't really make a difference. Um, I feel like there was a couple moments that uh, I didn't contest a couple shots, so my main focus was to uh, try to contest everything that was come to our basket, so it didn't time and score did not really matter to me. I was just trying to uh, contest shot and make a play. You had mentioned after the Hornets game, you said Charlotte's coming in this next one. You knew what they had done. What? How did you feel you all reacted or came to bounce back? In I think we, we did a good job. Uh, obviously, it's just a tough team. We just keep running, shooting open threes. You know, they have uh, great ball handlers, great uh, players that can create all the dribble and for themselves and for the team. Um, you know, guys can, they can shoot the ball. They all go for the rebound. They play hard. Um, so they're a really, really good team. Their record doesn't give them, you know, uh, justice. They're a really good team. Or maybe they just play well against us. I don't know, you know. But uh, we knew that we had to come in today and uh, play hard, uh, play our game, uh, play fast, play random, uh, play together, uh, create open threes. Crash the board, and most importantly, we, the other way we got to defend it, we got to rebound the ball because they're all crashing too. Uh, just Chris, kind of, I think in the final four minutes of the third quarter, he scores 11 points. You guys go on like a 16 to 5 run to close the third quarter. Um, I know you guys haven't been playing a lot together. It's been more Chris doing stuff while you're on the floor. So I guess I will ask you, what have you seen from him as you're kind of sitting there watching him? He's playing, he's playing well, playing real well. Um, Getting back your rhythm, great for himself, great for the team. Uh, obviously, um, he's playing 20 minutes. Uh, and in those 20 minutes, he really helps the team win, you know. Uh, and now he's coming off the bench and uh, he plays more. I don't, I don't think me and Drew and Chris play a lot together. Uh, usually, when Chris is on the floor, I'm probably out. But it just makes the game easier for everybody. You know, uh, he can create for himself. He can create for his teammates, and uh, especially when he's when he's out there, I can't wait to be out there with him and uh, you know, being able to you know screen for him, roll hard for him, create for him, for him, and him also create it for me and for the team. And it just it just makes the game easier for everybody. Without Bobby, you guys are playing some like smaller lineups. Mm -hmm. Just how much more difficult? I think this is like five or six games. How much more difficult is the rebound? Obviously, he's someone that grabs oh, a lot of boards. Yeah, he grabs a lot of boards. Um, he, shit, he's six, ten, six, eleven. You know, big body. Obviously, when uh, he's he's in there, um, defensively we way better, and uh, especially when you have to rebound the ball, we way better. But now we just gotta do what we gotta do. You know, uh, Bob's gonna be back soon with us, and uh, everybody gotta come back and help. It's not easy, uh, but uh, all, all our guards from Grace, from Pat, from Javon, from Drew, Joe, everybody that's out there gotta you know get back and uh, rebound the ball. Drew, I think, had a career high in rebounds tonight. Just how much did he kind of help? What do you have? Best career high? Ah, Charles Buckley. Uh, it's good. Like, that was that was the main focus, that you have to come back and help rebound. And uh, he did a great job. Whenever the ball went up, he came back and helped me and broke rebound. And especially when Brooke wasn't on the floor, he came back and helped me rebound. So, um, it's good. I don't, I'm not surprised that he had a career high. When a team plays at the pace that the Hornets try to play at, right? They just want to like get up and down, get up and down. Do you have to be cognizant of not trying to make your pace too fast too and play it's within? A, it's impossible. So you can try to slow down, but they still go fast. You know, they play up and down. And uh, I think today, previous game, we kind of tried to slow down the game and uh, it wasn't working out for us. But today, I think we kind of like, they were playing fast, we were playing fast. And uh, when he puts your score today, 120? 124, you know, so 
you know, that's how we play too. So uh, it's just it's just hard. It's just hard because like it's kind of like playing playing yourself. You know, like we're playing fast, we're shooting over three. They coming down, they shooting over three. We coming down, we shooting over three. They coming down, getting down. We coming down, getting like it's just the game gets fast. I was a little bit out of breath in a couple couple points of the game, but uh, it's good. It's good. It's good to play games like this. What's your I guess I know Bobby won't be out as long as Brooke was in last year in the sense that you, I mean you would talk about getting tired, just being one of only the two bigs and the small. What's your kind of threshold for that? How do you can you manage yourself if, if it's just you and Brooke in, in terms of how you? No, you just gotta play. You just gotta play through it and uh, do whatever it takes to help the team win. You know, I was uh, out for five games, also, and the team were playing hard. They were playing hard. They Won a couple of games and uh, they did what they had to do. Uh, you had to go go out there and compete, no matter who's playing. Uh, and now Bobby's not playing. We just gotta go out there and compete. And obviously, it might be a little bit harder for me and Brooke, but like we gotta do what we gotta do. Uh, and when he comes back, uh, our job becomes easier, you know. And uh, but we cannot focus on like okay, we can't wait for him to come back. So. Our, our load can be less, you know. Uh, when he comes back, you gotta, you gotta join. You gotta be, be, be aggressive. Also, be a beast, you know. So we, we all three, we gotta be aggressive on the offensive board, on the defensive board. We gotta try to block shots. You know, we're the biggest people on this team, and uh, we gotta protect our paint, and we gotta protect our guards. Thanks, Sarah.